This video is sponsored by our friends over at SENS Research Foundation. This episode of Life Noggin was filmed in front of a somewhat alive studio audience. Thank you, thank you, thank you. For over 200 years, vaccines have been protecting you humans from lots of different diseases by helping your bodies build immunity in case you come in contact with them. Kinda sorta like the restraining order I put on Mako, my barely evil twin. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he will go to jail if he violates it, yes. Now, scientists are developing vaccines to fight off harmful components created within your bodies, ones that are capable of causing organ failure and diseases like Alzheimer's. These components are called amyloids. Yes, yes, correct call with the booing. Amyloids are damaged molecules that have deformed and become sticky. When these sticky substances attach to organs or tissues, they can cause a lot of trouble. They build up between the cells and make it difficult for the organ to work effectively, which can result in organ failure. This can happen in many different parts of the body. For instance, the human brain contains tens of billions of interconnected cells called neurons that process and transmit information. But when beta amyloid proteins stick together in small chains that are abnormal but still able to stay dissolved in the fluid bathing the brain, they make it difficult for the neurons to communicate and function properly, and also cause the neurons to create other abnormal proteins that eventually result in their death. As you age, more and more of these soluble beta amyloid chains, called oligomers, are formed. But in people with Alzheimer's disease, this accumulation happens much, much faster, leading to the death of more and more brain cells and the loss of one's memory and thinking skills. But there are ways to remove amyloid oligomers from the brain, and one of these methods scientists have been exploring are vaccines. Yes, yes, we like vaccines. They're the reason you're not sitting in an iron lung right now watching this video. These kinds of vaccines work the same way as a vaccine against an infectious disease, by stimulating the immune system to create antibodies that capture and remove their target. In this case, that target is amyloids. Yes, throw your digital tomatoes at them. While there have been some promising results showing a reduction in the number of beta amyloid oligomers in mice, scientists are still working on making an effective vaccine for humans. Another treatment method is injecting pre-made antibodies into the body. This is called infusion therapy, and there's already one of these medications that has received accelerated approval from the FDA, after clinical studies found that it significantly slowed the progression of Alzheimer's disease. Another one was recently reported to work even better and is expected expected to get the FDA seal of approval soon. I know, but the possibilities don't end there. Scientists have found even more effective antibodies called catalytic antibodies, or catabodies. Instead of binding to an amyloid to begin the destruction process, they simply break into smaller, harmless pieces. This lets one antibody do the work of many antibodies in much less time. In fact, researchers believe that one catabody could destroy over 40,000 amyloids before it's eliminated by the body. So look out, amyloids. Your days are numbered just like Mako's days are numbered after violating my restraining order. Oh no! I'm about to hurt badly! Ow! So, only if you're comfortable with sharing your experience, let me know in the comment section below what is one condition that you've been suffering from. Maybe we can make a video about it and shed some light on it. If you want to learn more, check out the incredible work being done by SENS Research Foundation, our sponsor of this video. Click the first link in the description and show your support. Please do all the things that help this channel grow, we really appreciate it. Psst! You can get turned into a life noggin character. Seriously, find the Gleam Contest link in the description to enter. Click here to watch this video we did on cancer, potentially meeting its match. Or click here to watch this video. You can also check out the team at Lifespan that powers Life Noggin down in the description. As always, my name is Blocko. This has been Life Noggin. Don't forget to keep on thinking.